Hi everyone. Today I will introduce our network telephone cable tester NF8200 to all of you. It is made up by three parts: the emitter, receiver, and the remote. The remote has two ports: RJ45 and RJ11. The receiver has a strong and jammy ability. The main tester has three ports: main port, RJ11 port, and scan port. This device is used for tracing and verifying network cable and telephone cable, and measures these two kinds of cable lengths and locates the breakpoint. Now let's enter cable continuity testing. There are two working models. Locally testing and remote testing. Let's use an open network cable for remote testing. First, put one end of the cable into the main port of the emitter, and another end to the RJ45 port of the remote. Turn on the tester. Here we choose RJ45 and file mapping function. The result shows on the screen pin 1, 2, 4 and 5 is open. Then let me change a good network cable to operate locally testing. Then and change a good network cable to operate locally testing. Insert one end of the cable into main port, another end to the scan port of the emitter. Then we choose well mapping. We can see the result 1 to 1 until G to G. There is a local in the graph top corner, which means this is a good shared network cable. Now, let me tell you how to locate the cable break point. Let's take a network cable as example, which is broken. Firstly, we have to know how long the cable is. So, insert the end of the cable into the main port. Here we choose RJ45 and we choose the cable length from the main menu. We can see the result from the screen, number 2 to number 8 is 60.4 meters, only number 1 is 20.2 meters, which means this is the break point at 20.2 meters. Now, we are going to measure cable length for a two-core telephone cable, which is 100 meters. Connect one end to the RJ11 port of the emitter. Turn on the tester. Here we choose RJ11 and we choose the cable lens function. The result shows this cable is 90.2 meters, which means we need to calibrate it. Here we use calibration function. We adjust the cable length to 100 meters and save the data to calibration 1. Then we 
you need to load the data. Calibration one. Here we test the lens again. The result shows this cable is 90.9 meters, which is very close to 100 meters. This step can make the results more accurate and reduce the error. Finally, let me show you the function of chasing network cable on the Cisco switch. Now, let me unplug the network cable from the socket and insert it to the scan port of the emitter. Then turn on the tester. Here we choose RT45. Then we choose the scan cable on the main menu. Here is the scanning on the screen. Then we use the amplifier probe to get close to the Huawei switch. There is no sound. Here we move to turn the switch. We can hear no voice. Then we turn to Cisco switch. We can hear a clear and loud voice when we touch the switch. Let me unplug this cable. There is no voice. So, this is the target cable that we want to find out. This device is good at solving network cable and telephone cable problems. That's all about Noya Fa Network Telephone Cable Tester NF8200. Thank you.